had a shit day. It hasn't been the worst day, but it hasn't been the best day. And it's just one of those days, you know, we're like at the beginning of the week, it's like Tuesday, like a random Tuesday in the middle of the week. And today I just was not feeling the vibes. Um, yeah. So I am just going to get into my nighttime reset routine and kind of just like have a little like self-care productive nighttime routine so that I can just get rid of this vibe and have a fresh day tomorrow. And I figured we'd do it together because I would love the company. Let's just get into it. I really, 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 really want to change out of my clothes that I've been wearing all day. Um, but I want to take a shower and I also want to take a bath. Can I just say that instantly after that shower, I feel so much better. I feel like a new bitch, okay? I'm feeling good. So I still do want to take a bath because I want to sit in the salts and the bath bombs and all that. And I want to read my book because that just sounds so much fun. Before I do that, I think I want to put like a little face mask on and just kind of like wash my face, clean my face. I have been absolutely loving my skincare routine lately. And I truly feel like it is making a difference in my face from the last time that I showed you guys because I've just been breaking out and just getting a lot of unnecessary little spots that I have no idea are where they're from. I have started to become very, very intentional with my skincare routine and just like take my time. And like when I'm putting on my products, I'm just like imagining like what this product is doing to my face. And you guys, I think it's working, okay? So you know how when you brush your teeth when we were younger and they would say that you have to like say the whole alphabet and then you're done brushing your teeth and like your teeth would be clean? I feel like I should use that when I wash my face because I feel like I'm always like in a hurry to wash my face and I never know how long is long enough and like what's too long to be washing your face. So I'd just be singing songs and then when the song is over, then I'm done washing my face, you know? Or I can get like a little timer. I feel like that'd be cute too. Going in with the microfoliant. Look at that. Rub it in. Mmm. It feels like those body scrubs, but for your face, you know? So it just really, really, really makes me feel like my face is so clean after I do this. I feel like my nighttime skincare routine is really good. Like, I really feel like I got it down to a T. I just want that summer glow. I just want that clear skin. I just want that what's your skincare routine comment. You know what I'm saying? That's what I strive to have. ASMR. And then we're gonna go in with this Origins Active Charcoal Mask. I try to do masks at least like once a week. I feel like it's, I feel like just doing my regular skincare routine isn't enough. And that's why I like to like steam my face every day or as often as I can, dermaplane and like do the gua shine. Like I just feel like I only have one face. These little pimples just take away from the face and I hate it. But I try to do these face masks as often as I can. Not like every day, but at least like once a week is the goal just to help enhance all my other products in my routine i want to give it like a little extra push okay how do i look do you think i'm cute yes or no hey future ray popping in because i just wanted to take a second to talk about something that i have been so obsessed with lately and that is these magic mind productivity shots you guys first of all every single time i try to take immunity shots health shots energy shots whatever they always taste horrific but these genuinely taste so good and so sweet they remind me a lot of matcha because they have an ingredient that matcha also has i'll put it up here because i don't know what it's called and they also have a bunch of other healthy yummy ingredients that just help promote productivity it helps relieve anxiety it helps you stay more focused and motivated and energetic and it's just a 10 out of 10 product i've been obsessed with taking these every single day because it's just honestly made like such a big change in my energy levels throughout the day and also just like my focus because i feel like the adhd be kicking up okay sometimes it's hard for me to get things done in a timely manner this has been helping me a lot and i wanted to recommend it to you guys because this video is kind of just about like having things together and taking care of ourselves and this is a really good form of self-care because it's taking care of your mind it's taking care of your gut it's taking care of your everything and it's just a great product i'm gonna have a link down in my description below so you can get some money off of your first purchase yeah i just wanted to pop in here and say that but let's roll back and get into the rest of the video love you bye <laughs> Very 
nice. I'm having a good time. You know, I always forget like how fun taking a bath feels. Clean, obviously. You want to be clean. Like if you're taking baths and you haven't showered yet today, that's a problem. But like taking a bath, lighting a candle, getting your favorite book, listening to your favorite podcast, putting your face mask on. Oh my gosh, it is so fun. I feel like I'm just having so much fun. This has turned my day around, truly, guys. Wonderful. Anyways, I'm gonna enjoy this bath now i've been reading this book it is called oh no oh no i opened the drain i started this book it's called happy place by emily henry you've probably already heard of it i am so understanding the hype i love it so far and i typically don't read like fictional books and let alone like romance fiction and this is just it's reeling me in and it's making me want to read more books like this because i'm loving it i just do not want to put it down i'm literally reading like chapters every single day like i've never been so invested in a book and i just started it and i'm already like almost halfway through so The body is bathed, the jammies are jammed, and now it's time to put our skincare on while we defrost the salmon that I'm going to make for dinner. Oh yeah. I love routines. I know we know routines are important, but like routines are so important because this is like one of the things that I truly just look forward to so much at the end of the day. And even the beginning of the day, it really does set the tone. So how's your guys' day been so far? What did you guys do today? Today, my agenda honestly was not productive. My day today was none of the sort. I woke up this morning and I just did not feel like myself. Did not feel like doing my day-to-day -day routine. Funny enough that I'm just talking about how much I love routines. But today I did not really do my routines. I didn't work out today. I didn't do any yoga today. I didn't meditate. Today was just really, really off. I'm trying not to take today seriously. Today was just one of those days. We're going to move on. We're going to thrive. Tomorrow's a new day. Some days are just not going to be what you want them to be. But that doesn't mean that your life sucks. It doesn't mean that you suck. It doesn't mean that anything's wrong. It's just a day and it's gonna pass, okay? But I'm I'm having a good time tonight. I really feel like I'm turning my day around and it feels really fun and I'm doing all the things that I love. So happy Ray in the building. Okay. Dude, I love how my skincare feels. Everything just applies so smoothly. Everything just makes me feel like I am just this glowing fruit. Yes. Uh, look at that. We're glowing, babes. Okay, so I still have like 20 minutes on my my defrosting timer. While I wait, I'm also going to pick out my outfit for the gym tomorrow so that I make sure that I have no excuse not to go and I make it convenient for me and easy for me to want to get up and go to the gym. So we're gonna put together a cute outfit because we're doing upper body. Upper bod, upper bod. I'm gonna do my classic combo. It's gonna be my gray bootylicious shorts and then just this white top. Although I've worn this top so much to the gym that the armpits are dark. And so when I raise my arms, it's dark underneath and it makes me a little self-conscious. So, but honestly, like when I started doing this, it really, truly, truly makes everything so much easier for me in the morning because I feel like picking out an outfit, even if it's just for the gym, it takes me so long. And by the time I finally figure out if I ever do figure it out, I'm too lazy to put it on and keep going. So picking out my outfit, setting up my gym bag, filling up my water bottle, putting it in the fridge, planning out what I'm going to make for breakfast, all that stuff, like writing down my workout, all of it makes going to the gym so much easier and it makes it more likely to actually happen. The countdown to summer is crazy. It's already March. June is like when summer kind of starts for me. And so that's like two, three months away. But yeah, we need to get our summer bodies in order because it's just coming hella fast. Okay, now it is time to make some dinner because I am social hungry and I haven't eaten since like 2 p.m. On the menu tonight, when I went to the store earlier, I picked up these garlicky pasta noodles and I thought they would go really well with this salmon that I have defrosted so now it's time to put it in the oven. It's an Atlantic salmon with lemon herb butter and I'm also going to have a <laughs> I for some reason have been craving like chocolate milk and I originally wanted the Milo's if you know you know but it's not at Target and so I got this Yoo-hoo instead. Let's actually try it. Cheers. <sighs> it's so good.
some green onions from my green onion garden to put into the pasta. Oh yeah, love this life. For the salmon and the pasta to finish cooking i'm actually going to start making the dessert for tonight it's the banana bread mix from trader joe's and it's literally li it's literally like three ingredients and you just need eggs vegetable oil and water and it takes around like 40 minutes to cook so i'm actually going to start mixing it right now so that once the salmon is done i can plop this in there and then have that cook while we eat so excited because i don't ever really get to bake things i usually only just like cook like savory stuff but Baking is so much fun. I've got my little bread pan. Perfect for the occasion. I need two eggs. I usually get brown eggs, but they did not have brown eggs today. So I have one more brown egg left and then the rest are white eggs. I assumed I had vegetable oil. I may have assumed wrong. That is an issue. Guys, I thought I had vegetable oil. It would taste weird with olive oil, right? No, it's really good. Really? Yeah, are you sure? Okay, we're gonna take his word for it, guys. But if it's nasty, we know who to blame, okay? Mmm. Good job, Raven. She did it again. Okay, I'm gonna eat this and then we're gonna check in when the banana bread is done. It's time. And she's looking really golden and crispy. Look at that. Mmm. Okay, 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 okay. That looks good. Okay, we need to cool it down for a little bit though. <laughs> Okay, it may not be the most aesthetic thing, but it's looking really yummy. I'm a bit nervous about the olive oil, but let's see if it tastes good. Here's our bite. Okay, we've got the chocolate chips in it, the crust, the middle. Cheers. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I think that piece didn't really taste much like banana. I feel like the chocolate may be a little overwhelming, but it's still good. I threw it in a little bit longer because I thought it was raw. I don't think I needed to do that. It was just moist for a three ingredient banana bread. This is delicious. Ah, yes. Now is the time where I go to bed. That was my whole night routine, guys. I really hope you guys enjoyed. Thanks for hanging out with me. Thanks for boosting my mood because I legit was not in the mood earlier, but you guys changed my mood and you made me feel so much better and I love you so much for that. And I'm just going to bed super happy, super comfortable, super cozy, and it's just all the best. So thank you guys so much for watching this far if you have made it this far. And if you have, comment your favorite emoji so I know you made it this far. As always, I will see you guys in the next video. I love you so much and I hope you have an amazing rest of your day or night whenever you're watching this. Bye! Bye.